Hello everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So, oh, also Happy New Year's. I'm going into 2022. So, I didn't have a plan on to do this kind of video. So I'm going to actually do it. And I'm not going to go into details. If he says we can, then him and I will do the video together. So, if you saw that little short video, I will post it at the end of this video. Um, that um, Kaya and I broke up. We are not dating, we are just friends. I'll collect flowers while talking, why not? We're just friends, we are not anything else but friends for now or forever we're not even sure what's gonna happen well, yeah. to us in the future so we'll see what happens but i'm not gonna talk for him but i'm not gonna go into a relationship right now but if he asks me back then I will go back with him but I'm not gonna go in a relationship with anyone else but him for now I'm because I've been in really rough other relationships and I don't want to go back into it so and this one we've been together for nine months and it is one of the hardest ones I went through. I was so happy and thankful that I had friends. I had friends who helped me through it. I'm actually going to say my friends' nicknames. And I was so happy for having friends like them. And it's amazing what happened. And they have helped me. So when it broke, when it happened, um, I contacted Scissors and Rainy and some other my other friends. But Scissors, um, I'm not gonna talk to her anymore about it because it does affect it does affect her actually but the main people that I've been talking to the most about it because they told me that I can come to them and talk to them about it I don't really talk to Ash about it and I have another friend named Ash too so that both Ashes I don't really talk to them about it but the friends that I really talk about it with is Stitches and Izzy, oh my god, they've been there for me since day one of the breakup. That was on Tuesday, and it was really hard. I was so glad that we didn't go anywhere. It happened Tuesday morning. Um, when he woke up, he texted me, said he had to talk to me. It was quite important so we did the call I hinted that he was gonna break up I hinted it he just had to say I need to talk to you something and it was very hard for him to say it I I knew what he was gonna say I don't know how I knew that I texted him are we breaking up he said that's what I want to talk to you about I went on mute right away because I was so upset and I'm gonna start crying actually so that's why I'm talking a little different but I went on mute right away he told me he had reasons I'm not gonna explain the reasons um it was quite hard for me it was very hard I was so happy that I had Stitches and Izzy there. Those two I counted on from the start. 
um, I was able to count, uh, be able to count on my other friends, but they don't really want nothing to do with it. They really didn't. They really Kaya and them didn't like each other, so I don't really talk to them that much about him. I talk to Izzy and Ash because they understand. Not Ash, sorry. Izzy and Stitches. Izzy and Stitches has helped me so much. They were able. They, whenever I needed to call, I just said hi. Can I call you? I just need a friend. Yes, they said yes. I would be on call with them for hours. We talked. They helped me. They comfort me, and now I'm crying again. Um. But. Kaya and I are still texting each other. We're friends. We are not gonna unfriend each other unless it's too hard for both of us. But for now, we're friends. We're texting. We're calling. Nothing has changed on that. But I'm closing myself off of him. Meaning, what I mean by that, I'm not opening up to him as I used to. Um, he is, I'm letting him, I'm letting him open up with me still, cause I am that kind of person, I don't, I like to help them if needed, I help all my exes like that, so I have helped him still, and I'm really glad that he still comes to me with that kind of stuff, and I can help him and give him some advice, and that. But the thing, the hardest thing for me right now, it is, I'm not on call with him. I'm, like, him and I was on call all day, every day, all night. And I'm used to sleeping with him on call. I can't sleep anymore. I don't sleep well at night anymore. Because i grown attached to what he wanted to do, like stay on call for the night and that. So I was so attached to that. Now I'm not. No, I am still attached. Sorry. I am still attached. I'm not on attached. I'm still attached. Um, so it is really hard still on me. He is doing fine. He's doing perfectly fine. It didn't hit him, strike him, but the hard part for him, he had to, he had to break it off. I wasn't ready to lose him. I, him and I saw a future together. We were so close. We knew what we wanted in the future together and all of that. But I'm not gonna go in detail. We. I know you guys are asking for a detailed video. We are not. I'm not gonna go into details without asking him if he wants that. If he does, we'll make a video together. And I think I'll be on Genshin with him, or I'll just be running around on Star Server like I'm doing right now, collecting stuff. But um, yeah, we are. We're both single. I'm not, I'm not rushing into a relationship, but if he wants to get back together, then I'll go back with him. I don't really want to go in another relationship with someone else right now, because this is nine months. Like, come on. Almost a year. And it's hard. So, I don't. I'm not gonna probably post much videos right now because of the breakup. I might post again in sometimes the middle of January or in February because I, I need some time to um, recover from this. She was so special and important to me and um, the good thing is, we are friends, we are still talking to each other. I'm just 
so glad we're still talking and we're texting so yesterday i was tired and i was gonna i was gonna say hey i'm gonna go to sleep i'll talk to you tomorrow but i had a feeling i had to stay up with him so i did i stayed up till he went to sleep I was happy that I did because he needed to talk to someone. I don't, and other stuff is happening to me that I've told him about, and he, I don't know, he doesn't really understand it. And I told my friend Izzy about it, and she was like, she was really confused on what's happening and all that, but I'm gonna talk to Stitches about it. But it is. Weird, but I'm not gonna say it in the video. It's personal. But if he decides, if he says yes to do a video about it in detail, we will do it. But we're just on a break. A break. Um, I don't know if it's for good. I don't know. It could be just for a couple of weeks <laughs> or a couple of months or years. Or forever. Um, I'm not even really sure what it is right now. But for now, I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna say. Oh, it's a breakup. It's forever. I'm just gonna deal with it. It's just as a break. I don't like. I don't like calling it a breakup. I just call it a break. But it is really hard and. I was so thankful that I had friends there and they helped me. Izzy and Stitches, Ash and Stitches, those three are the ones who helped me a lot. But Izzy helped, Izzy and Stitches helped the most. Um, because I don't really talk to the both Ashes or scissors about it because it does affect scissors so much and she told me not to bring it up anymore so I don't bring it up to her anymore I talk to Izzy or Stitches about it because I don't want to talk to someone about it who says don't talk to me about it or that Izzy and Stitches has been my true friends if they're all my true friends that scissors is my true friend too but right now Stitches and Izzy are my closest friends and I and I was able to talk to them and it's easy but I have I'm not gonna go into another relationship. I'm not I don't want one right now. I Really can't handle it But if it's with him I will because I still care about him. I I really really love him I don't I still have feelings for him I am always gonna have feelings for him. I am not over him. Not at all. Um, I cried for the three or four days. I hardly slept, ate, or anything like that. Um, if I ate small meals, I didn't really do much. But. It is affecting me quite a bit. She didn't know I was going to take it this much. It because he kind of felt bad that he hurt me like that. But of course, it is going to hurt someone if you're breaking up with them. But of course, it will. So I'm just glad that we're friends, we're talking, we're texting, so I am very happy about that. So, alright guys, I'm going to end the video here because I'm going to start crying because I'm actually holding in my tears right now. I need to cry it out right now. Um, I know you guys want to in detail. I'll talk to him about it tomorrow. I don't want to bug him on New Year's because he's with his family. Mm, I'll talk to him tomorrow about it. If he's okay with going into detail, him and I will both do it together. Um, and 
I'm not gonna continue the relationship tips anymore. Okay, she didn't text me back. Okay, I'm not gonna go and do the detail tips anymore. I I'm done with it for now. I will definitely I'm gonna delete them. But the ones that are gonna uh, all my other videos will stay. Um, the playlist I have called Play with Kaya that's staying there. I'm still doing videos with him. I'll still record with him because him and I will still do games together. Like I still play Genshin with him. I still play Roblox with him. I'll still record with him. So I'm not gonna stop it yet. I'm not gonna delete those videos. The videos with him, they're all staying on my channel. I'm not deleting them because they are memories for me. Um, the Angel Gamers, yes, I'm not gonna post on there. So the videos from there, I'll post them on this channel. But I am not gonna post the videos with hi how him and I actually looks like in real life. Him and I did it because he has a channel where he shows himself and I am thinking to start a channel like that of myself. So for now, I'll just post like the gaming ones. I'm not going to post the videos of us. So they, those videos were made a long time ago, but I'll post them. So I'll end the video from here. If you guys have questions or anything, you guys can contact me on Discord. I will put my Discord below. I am going to remake the Discord server. It's going to take weeks to do. So when I'll keep you updated on how it looks. But when it's done, you guys can join. And tomorrow, I might be buying another horse on Bethany. So I'll record again tomorrow. But after that video, I'm not going to post for a while. Or if I don't record tomorrow, I'm not going to buy a horse. I'll just save star cards. But okay guys, I'm gonna end the video. I am not joining any clubs. I'm gonna stay off of Star Stable for a while on these three accounts. Um, my friend is starting a club tomorrow. So you guys know her. No, you guys don't know her, but I'll do a video with her. And she doesn't, she has this YouTube channel. She's not doing a voiceover, she's doing titles and that, and it's a Discord required club, but she's gonna, I'll do a video with her sometimes, and I'll talk about her club, maybe while she does lessons, maybe. Alright guys, I'll see you guys some other time. If I don't post on Saturday, you guys will see me sometimes in January or February. Because I just need to recover this. Um, you guys can text me on Discord. I'll talk to him if he's up to doing that video. Him and I will do it in January. Alright, guys. We'll see you guys soon. Happy New Year's. Adios.